check us out on Patreon, guys, where we're giving you the entire year now for $10.08. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> Over 100 videos worth of content for $10.08. $0.08 eight cents is just such a slap in the face. <laughs> Like 84 cents some month, I think is what it comes out to. I haven't seen 84 cents in 15 years. I'm telling Ever you. since Penny Candy. So check us out on Patreon, guys. Hope to see you there. The entire year. <laughs> what's up, guys? Your boys are back. I'm Ryan, my man, George. Yeah, what's up, guys? How you living out there, man? Shout out Metal to the uh, the free thinkers, of course. Metallica. You already know, man. It's about that time, man. But before we get this Metallica party started, man, yeah. shout out to our sponsor, Unbound Marino, for hooking us up with the shirts, man. I'm, I've been kind of rocking this on my off time, though, Dude, too. I, I've been working out you know? in it. So. You know, this is a the very high-quality sort of athleisure-type shirt yeah, that you can dude. wear casually. You can yeah. wear it to the gym. You know, high-quality stuff, man. So check them out. Their information will be uh, in our description. Now, getting back to Metallica, man. We did um, Welcome Home Sanitarium, which was fire, by the way, man. Shout out to everybody on Patreon, man. It's helping us out with the website, man. Yes, getting man. all the bugs out. Um, cause we, we posted that on the website, man. So, and that kind of exposed a lot of new bugs. So we really appreciate you guys, um, helping us, helping out, us out and your input. And also we did that disposable heroes. That's also mm -hmm. on Patreon, man. That one Ooh, at wait. this point, I'm, I'm not going to say it yet, but that is in the running for my favorite Metallica song. So if you guys are interested in seeing those videos, man, definitely, uh, check out the Patreon, uh, information below. Check out our link for Patreon, man. All right, man. With all that being said, man, it's time for Creeping Death. Trying to ride the lightning, bro. Yeah. <laughs> that, that name is actually really dope, though. Yeah. It like, is. no bullshit. Mm -hmm. I mean, we've heard this for years now. We know yep. Metallica riding the lightning. We know of the album, clearly. And we've mm -hmm. done Fade to Black off the album. From Whom the Bell Toll. From Whom the Bell Toll. Yeah. I think that's all right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was like, yeah. that doesn't quite sound no, like it. I don't know, but I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't even, I'm not even going to try. Mm -hmm. Fuck it. <laughs> So this album came out in 1984, um, and just like George said, we did for Whom the Bell Tolls. Actually, I didn't. I said From, which I fucked up on. So. I, think we, <laughs> I think we both the, fucked up. I think we both fucked up. For Whom the Bell Tolls. I think I said From Whom the Bell and then I sung the shit at yeah. <laughs> Anyways, yep. Go ahead, Ryan. My uh, and then uh, Fade to Black. Now we're doing Creeping Death. Gotta do Creeping Death. Big, big request mm -hmm. for quite some time. Um, quite frankly, we we uh, we said this and we said this in one of our other videos. We just have a certain crop of bands that happen to be just what we call palate cleansers, man. Bands, yeah, bands man. that have earned our trust. Bands that we just kind of feel that you know when we get into this groove of of either just not liking songs or. <laughs> appreciating songs but knowing we'll never play them in life right, right we can always go back to these bands not always but most of the time when we go back to these bands we're going to find a, a song that makes our playlist that's really going to consistently be a song that we play over time there's yeah, been man. there's been a let me say this now because we say a lot uh, uh we say this a lot on patreon there have been plenty of bands that i was excited about that set that i was like yes playlist great song and then I would say maybe a month later, that band is just nowhere to be found on yeah, my playlist. Yeah. So you can make the playlist, but staying on the playlist, mm -hmm. you know, what we've we found is, uh, is a completely different ball game. And Metallica is one of those bands that stays on the playlist. All right, man, let's get into this one. Big time request for, uh, from you guys for quite some yeah. time, man. Metallica, Creeping Death. Mm -hmm. Yeah, buddy. Rev it up. I gotta pause it already. Let's, we'll bring it back, guys. Mm. Um, I just want to touch on this really, really fast because I don't want to break the flow. I know we all jamming out right now, mm. man. I love the little. We said this before in other videos, man. But it's just, it. I, I don't know if it's difficult because I don't play instruments. But dude, those little, the the all those little nuances that they do within the music, man. 
that makes such a huge impact on me. It does, man. It does, man. Me too. And I'm just like, damn, that's fire. And um, maybe someone that plays an instrument or plays a guitar or plays or drums or whatever the case may be, they may be like, you know what? That's not even that difficult, man. That, that's easy to do. I don't care if it's easy to do or not. That shit sounds crazy. And yeah. it, it just makes, it make, it brings out an emotion. That shit is so important, man. It is, though. It can never be understated, man. Absolutely. You, what, what is that? I want to know, like, maybe we can call it uh, something for what Metallica does, man. But they do an amazing job at catching you at the top of your groove, right? Because there's a build. Even when you're grooving, there's a build up to it. You're like, oh, I like this. Oh, I really like this. And then right when you're like, I really like this. Then, it's, then they go. Yeah. And then you're like, oh, this is out of here. Yeah. Right? So they catch you Ooh. as you're. As they're building the music, they're getting you more and more into a groove. And at the top, at the peak of your groove, then they hit you with some of those, whatever that is, whatever yeah. you want to call it, those dynamics in the music that's just like, oh, yeah, this is this is crazy. And, and to your point, that's the way it started. It started, it was like, yeah, and then they, and it was so, it was what, like a three different uh, transitions just in the beginning yeah. or something like that? Dude. So yeah. it was high octane, too. out of here, man. Metallica, yeah. man. I must, I must, I must say something, man, and it may be controversial. We'll see. We'll see. I don't know if this is going to be the video, man, but it's going to happen, man. I'm going to hurt, hurt a lot of feelings. Let's run that back. All right, let's get back to it. You know it's going to be some shit from the jump. tone and everything. You hear it. It just, I'm suing Metallica though, man. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Oh, y'all gonna pay for my Botox procedure, man. Because I'm getting wrinkles, man. From, <laughs> from the stink faces, man, that you're making your head bad. I've been had like, them, man. Damn. I, I really do feel like that's been a thing over the years, man, with me making these stink faces. <laughs> Metallica's a big a big part of that, man. Yeah, that when they held that note right there. Ding, ding. Because they, they rev it up. They got they have this revving thing that they do with their riffs. And that, that's just, I feel like, I've, I've heard other bands do it, but I really feel like that's a signature of Metallica yeah. to keep the intensity going throughout the song. It's revving. I hear it. Love it. They rev it. And then they, again, these these these, uh, these sort of dynamics, man. The -da 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 -da. Yep. When they did that, went up and down the scale mm -hmm. right there. I was like, okay. So let, let's run that back. <laughs> I know it was mid, mid groove there. Let's run it right on back.
Right here, mm, mm, just a mm, bam, mm, and then also, you know, as Ryan mm, mentioned, man, with that symbol just um, going a blasting mm, in the background mm, right at the peak, it's just I love, love, love those riffs, bro. I'm sorry, had to it's stop. It's a damn shame. Uh, this uh, just to kind of take a quick detour here, man. I guess this is based on the story of the first Passover from the Book of Exodus. It's mm. saying, "Creeping death is a brutal retelling of the story of the Angel of Death." When the Pharaoh refused to release the Hebrew slaves, God sent down an angel to take the lives of every for firstborn child mm -hmm. unless the house was marked with blood. But I can see the angle with having a metal interpretation of that story. Mm -hmm. You know, how brutal, you know, the brutality of yep. it. Uh, so let me get back to it.
They just obliterate everything it feels like. Nah. Yo, they were just in their bag, man. Right in this period, man. Right there. That's the, you guys say the first four albums, man. They obliterated that song. <laughs> Damn. It's crazy, man. dude. It's not a shocker that they are as famous as they are, man. You know, um, I feel like something like this just took the world by storm. Because when you hear them play, if you like rock, let's say fuck metal. If you like rock, you should like the way this sounds. If you're um, a, a classic rock guy, you should like the way this sounds. And this really kind of came full circle for me with when I'm listening to this song, is it has like um, rock elements, but it's more um, harsher than rock. Mm -hmm. But it, it has rock elements and progressions, and, and it's just so groovy, man, mm -hmm. and which is why I like a lot of the uh, southern rock sounds, because it's so like... Um, the, 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 the song that comes to mind to me is that Sweet Home Alabama. Every time I hear that, I'm like, yeah, that's just a great song. Because yep. it's just the melody in, in the uh, guitar playing is just so great. And I feel like um, when Metallica, when they play, I feel like they have that rock-like mm -hmm. um, solid foundation. I feel like that that's probably where they I, I I'm just I'm just spitballing guys, but I feel like that's their that's where they come from is a rock background. Mm -hmm. Cause that's what I hear. Even in the drumming um with Lars, I'm like, yeah, it sounds like that could be something that a southern rock group would play, you mm -hmm. know? But it's just more intense. So I feel like, man, um, it's not a shock that Metallica had the commercial success that they did, because they have so many elements, I believe of music that you can just identify, but you understand that they're doing something different within the musicianship. Absolutely. And dude, and when I hear it, it just, it, I'm, it, 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 so much emotions come out of me when I listen to Metallica, like, dude, this is just fire. Oh, did, did you, did, 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 damn, they did this, they did this, and they did that. It's just so fire. So dude, I really have to give them credit um, for what they're able to do. And I, and I think it's well-deserved that this band is so well-liked and so well-loved. But I feel like the people that dislike Metallica for whatever reason, I think the reason is um, that they, are, they were so commercially successful that it was just cool to just dislike, oh, they, 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 that's commercial. And it's not really commercial. It has commercial appeal because it's great. <laughs> the shit's just great, dude. So man, that's playlist for me as usual, man. That um, is super play. It's just dope, man. They're just dope. Yeah, man. From start to finish, they obliterated that song, though, no, man. Start to finish. They, they just didn't let up throughout the entire song. So that's playlist. Um, and you said something at the end of that, Ryan. Uh, you were like, you know, they're just great. And, um, you know, look, man, I understand that there's certain music. Um, sometimes, man, you run into artists that it, it just requires more of you to really sit with the music and um, to really try to understand what they're yeah. trying to, to give you. And I get that. And I don't want to take anything away from, um, um, from just uh, artists and, and, and whether it be extremely uh, uh, intricate prog uh, epics and you know, <laughs> classical pieces and all that other stuff that you really, you know, things from Pink Floyd and mm -hmm. Led Zeppelin and these, these 20, 15 minute songs. And that's, dude, that's, that's, it's beautiful in itself. That sounds tiring. <laughs> but there is something to be said, man. There's just been a handful of artists and bands in my life where I feel like um, the music, it just, I don't have to try to, to get into it, to enjoy it. I know that it's good. I know that it's great. I know that it takes skill. I know that it's, um, it, it, it's, it's transcendent. It has a transcendent quality in it versus yep. people who are just in this niche uh, uh -huh. demographic that really love it. And Metallica fits the bill, man. They're a band that it's just, their greatness is obvious. It's not something where I'm like, oh, I have to be completely immersed in this culture yeah. to get. Sometimes, man, when we do these videos and we get people and they, and they, they, they give us these requests, man, it's sometimes I listen to stuff and I'm like, yeah, I appreciate it, man, but I'm, I'm not sure if it's ever going to have the effect on me as it does on fans of the band. And that's perfectly fine. It's okay. It's all subjective. But I'm happy that this band is exactly what you guys said they were. They are exactly what you said they were. Incredible. <laughs> That's all we heard from Metallica, Metallica, Metallica. And there's a reason why every time we put a Metallica video up, it's out of here. So salute to, to the Kings, man. There it is. All right, guys. So that's it. That's the end of the video. If you enjoyed that, please hit the like button. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And also, guys, we do have a Patreon channel if you're interested. The link for that will be in the description. You can check that out. And once again, a big shout out to our sponsor, Unbound Marino. The link for their information will also be in the description. I'm George. That's Ryan Lawson Vegas. We out. We out.